Dude, I was stressing that we're gonna come out of freaking strut. I was like, Holy three? Holy cow. Three? Three? <laughs> three what? I kept saying three. <laughs> three? <laughs> Well, we still pretty much shot them in strut, but... Well, whatever we did, they ain't flopped. They ain't even flopped, <laughs> bro. They, they are DRT. <laughs> Garrett had decided that we were going to try to go get me another bird and try to get another video on and we went to one of my hunting leases that Friday morning and we, we heard several different gobblers and we just really couldn't get any of them to work out. Um, we actually got up and we're walking out and spot a strutter. We, we tried to kind of creep up on him and pretty sure the hens made us. We tried to get up on him a little bit. He, he was kind of out in the wide open, so there weren't no good way to sneak to him. So we sat there and called and called, and as we tried to move up a little bit on him, pretty sure we got busted. They, uh, they took off and went this way. So I don't want to push him because I don't want to push him off the property. So we came right here, looked at the road, found some strut marks where that one got hung up this morning. And it's pretty open, good visibility. Um, that we found us a good little hide. Pretty sure he's roosting literally maybe 100 yards that way or less. So, come back in the morning, see if we can't get on. Stay tuned. That afternoon, I had actually got a picture from one of my cameras, and I had two strutters at the same field where the Oklahoma guys doubled up the week before. Nate sends me a text that evening, and uh, it's a picture, trail cam, two strutters on it, different spot. So I sent the picture to Garrett and I was like, hey man, I know we got a game plan for tomorrow morning, but we got an opportunity here with me and you might actually get to double up and we've never been able to do that together. Usually one of us is always holding a camera. We always, you know, said that that'd be something that would be cool for us to be able to do one day. And you know, that opportunity never really presented itself until now. And so it was kind of one of those things of, we don't want to miss that chance while it's here. We finally decided, you know, we're, we're gonna try it. We're gonna go go for the double self film the whole thing. This random Tom had just came out of nowhere and crossed this field silent, never gobbled a, a one time that whole morning. We never knew he was over there and just came right in on a string, just c completely caught us off guard. We were more confused than anything, but it was like there was a chance Nate could have shot that bird, but it's like it, it happened so quick that, you know, we, we didn't, nobody knew that he was going to run up to the decoys, hop 10 feet in the air, and then just sprint out of here. We still had those birds behind us that, that hadn't showed yet, but they didn't seem like they were coming any closer. If anything, they seemed like they were getting further away. Ended up having some hens that came out in the field, 
and we watched them for a good little while and and even they were a little unsure about what was going on once those hens left and we were able to get on the call a little bit it weren't long we realized they had came all the way out and we're in this field it sounded like now so we've we've got them back we're still in the game um and then that's when that long anticipating wait turned into a hundred mile an hour. I'll go right, you go left, I will hold on, hold on, hold on. I'll go right, you go left. Coming in clutch right there, son. Golly. That was probably one of the most stressful <laughs> freaking hunts. Did I was stressing that we're gonna come out of freaking stress? It was like Holy three. God. Three. Three. <laughs> three what? I kept saying three. <laughs> three. <laughs> well, we still pretty much shot him in strut, but. Well, whatever we did, they ain't flopped. They ain't even flopped, bro. <laughs> they are DRT. <laughs> hey. Tagged out. Tagged out. Cameraman Week double. Week two. Cameraman double. Marshmallow round two. <laughs> hey, second double here. Second double. In two weeks. Same setup as exactly a week ago. <laughs> I finally got to double up with Gary. I mean, we've been hunting together for a while. And being able to film hunts is one thing. And, you know, I filmed his birds. He's filmed mine. But the fact that we just both went film together, which is something we don't get to do often, usually we're splitting up with other people. So not only did we get to film a hunt together, but we got to kill a bird together and double up. That, that right there is something I've been looking forward to doing since we've been turkey hunting together. I can't believe that just happened. I can't believe we just shot a double there for the second weekend in a row. I can't believe me and Nate finally shot a double together. Something that we've been trying to do for so long and we're finally able to make it happen and film it at the same time. It was definitely something truly special and probably my favorite hunt of the season for sure. Dirty hunt, but we is tagged out. <laughs> I guess we're done. <laughs> yeah. I like it. <laughs> <laughs>